boys. It's hot in Georgia. Woo! BBC stand for in this case? Is that going to be a uh, British Broadcasting Channel? Perhaps it's Big Black Cock. They aren't a Jeep. They aren't a Jeep after all, boys. Perhaps they just like the Big Black Cock. Because it's a boy in there. It's like a, like a fun time. Oh my goodness, boys. It wasn't a boy. It was a girl. Yeah, it was. So and It was a pink sticker, so I guess she likes the Big Black Cock. Bad girl. Holy shit. Can somebody do the freaking speed limit, boys? I saw you, man. My bad. Hey, you all right? You all right, man? So clearly, clearly I'm going to have to start bringing my camera into Walmart. I couldn't get my phone out quick enough before she decided to change her fucking mind and stop being a silly bitch. Apologize. But, I bought two, bought three shirts yesterday. Bought three of these button-ups. This is a large. It's the one I tried on. I bought a gray one and a tan one, also in large, which I did not try on because I assumed they were, since they were the exact same shirt made by the exact same company, they would indeed be the exact same size, but they weren't. Uh, the fabric was cut differently, apparently, which my wife informed me as she used to work in the Texas tile industry years ago as a commonplace practice. Not a commonplace practice, but a common thing to happen, I guess. Um, so I, and of course I took the tags off when I got home because I was going to wash all three of them. But then I tried on the other two just for shits and giggles and uh, noticed they didn't fit. I'm like, fuck. So the tags, the little tags that they put on and weren't on. You know, the little, not stapled on, but the little whatever plastic jobby dude tags. Uh, so I get the customer service. There's somebody in line. She leaves pretty quickly. I get up and, there. Uh, I tell her exactly what I just told you. And so she starts looking at the inside tags of the shirt and then proceeds to tell me that the inside tag on the gray shirt doesn't match the receipt. And I'm like, I don't know what to tell you. Bought them all three yesterday from this Walmart at the exact same time, you know. So I'd just like to go ahead and exchange them for one size up, you know, or get my money back and buy the two up sizes, you know, whatever, however it works. And we just get this done. Being polite and cordial, mind you, just concise. She did explain, I understand what you're saying, sir. It's just that this tag on the inside of the shirt doesn't match the receipt. 
I'm like, lady, I didn't sew the shirt. I didn't sew the tag into the shirt. All right? Like, what's the fucking problem? Like, are you fucking kidding me? Not being that much of a dick, but still. So, in exasperation, like, as I'm pulling out my phone, about to film this silliness, she proceeds to tell me to just kind of, she sighs, and she's like, all right, just go get the shirts and come back. Hang on to the receipt. So I did. I wasn't gone 55 seconds. At which point, there was like three other people in line, and I jumped to the front. I obviously walked around the little barricades and stepped at the front of the line, not cutting any people off, just kind of hung out at the side. To which she immediately had to look up and say, sir, you need to go to the back of the line. I'm like, uh, I was already in line. Why would I need to go to the back of the line? And she's like, because you stepped out of line. I'm like, yeah, because you told me to go get the fucking shirts. And, uh, <laughs> And, and she said, yeah, but these people were already in line before you. I said, no, I was before all of them, including the lady you're already helping, because I was already in line being helped by you. And then, of course, the lady in the back, the, the lady, the next lady, she's like, you can go ahead. And uh, I was like, no, it's fine. Please go ahead. I'm just like, and then I explained it all to her. What's going on? I'm like, I don't know why this has got to be a big deal. Like. I wrongly assumed, I guess, that a large shirt made by the same company in the same exact style would be a large shirt, regardless of the color, but apparently my mistake, no, no, that's not the case. So can I just do a quick exchange, whoop you whoop no big deal, like probably no even money involved since I just needed the same price, right? But it's gonna be a fucking fiasco and a huge goddamn deal. She totally understands. We proceed to converse on the subject of how we don't like giving our money to the Waltons anyway, we both prefer to give them to mom and pop operations and or be as self-sufficient as possible. We go to Walmart as little as possible, but most of us don't have a choice. As it's the cheapest game in town, and in many cases, it's the only game in town. So, that's my little fucking rant. Fuck Walmart. You sons of bitches, I've given you tens of thousands of dollars. Go fuck yourself. We almost died, boys. Holy shit. That simmer almost killed us. Just look onto it, boys. Can you even freaking sans it? need to dig me a brand new well. Give me the pipe. Okay, freaking dead. We got a cop behind us, boys. I'm a little nervous. Peeting! Yay! We didn't go to prison, boys. Woo! Love that guy! Doing pork chops tonight. Don't give a fuck, but I'm hungry. Boys, can you even sant the beauty of it? I wonder if she'll turn into a triangle. Hey? The old triangle diamond, fuck's sakes. Oh, shit, when she's not too bright, no triangle diamond, but I'm a shaky fucker. Alright, got the tripod out here. See if we can do a little better. Oh, that's pretty fucking badass, boys. The zoom is pretty good, or the moon is pretty close, one of the two. Damn, you can totally see the fucking crater right there. That's pretty badass. I'm gonna try to lose it, trying to center it. That is pretty cool that you can see a fucking crater on the moon with this camera. I mean, maybe it's a shadow. It fucking looks like a crater to me. Of course it's not a shadow. What am I talking about? That's what all that shit is, is cratering, right? Must be. That is absolutely just hanging out. 
Nope. Well, fucking ant pile, fuck's sake. How you doing? Give him a little wake up. Alright, wakey wakey. Eggs and bakey. Where are you wakey? Okay. Somebody's waiting on pork chops, probably. Somebody's waiting on pork chops. Waiting on pork chops? Waiting on pork chops? Is pork chops terrible? Boys. Ah!